Hey everyone, Keith here, Tips and Tricks HQ. In this quick video, I'm going to demonstrate how to use the WP Video Lightbox plugin for WordPress. And in my example, I'm going to show how to use a YouTube video in the Lightbox. But you can do the same with uh, Vimeo as well. Alright, I'm just going to grab this short code here. As you can see here, there's uh, different short codes um, depending on what, what it is you want to do. And I'll give you the basic example here. I pasted it in here using the video underscore lightbox underscore YouTube short code. And what you have to do is specify the video ID, um, first of all. So what you do is you look at a YouTube video, and whatever shows up after the V equals, that's what you copy over to the video ID parameter in the short code. And you can specify the width and height as well. And if you want it so that a thumbnail shows up automatically, so if you want the plugin to automatically pull the thumbnail from YouTube, then you put auto underscore thumb equals one in there. And you can also specify an alt text for that particular image that gets pulled in. In addition, if you want to disable the related videos that show up at the end when the video is done playing, you just have to add this part just after the video ID. So I'm going to go ahead and save this and then view it in a browser. Okay, so it's set up so that it automatically pulls in a thumbnail from YouTube and related videos are turned off and I'm just going to click on that and now he, as you can see it opens up in a new window and that alt text also displays up here as the title of the image I'm sorry as the, as the title of the light box all right I'm just going to close that and so now if we don't want to use um, the thumbnail image from YouTube, we can put anchor equals, and then we can specify any text in here. So if we go on, we can put, click here. Right. Save that. So instead of an image that shows up now on this page, it should be just the um, text. Click here. And it does the same thing. So when somebody clicks it, opens up, light box, and then the video displays. And in the same way, you could paste the URL of any image that you have into the anchor parameter, and that is what will, will be used as the anchor for that light box. All right, that's all I got for now. Again, this is Keith, Tips and Tricks HQ. Thanks for watching.